Now to a story that is positively San Diego as we celebrate Valentine's Day. ABC 10 News reporter Marie Cornell joins us live from Mama's Kitchen in Webster. And Marie, this nonprofit is doing more than just cooking up food for those who are in need. They are also stirring together some uh, love connections. Hey, Jim, yeah, the CEO of Mama's Kitchen says they try to make a difference in the community that they serve, and in the process, several relationships have blossomed. Before Brad and Summer became Brad and Summer Steck, they were two people who grew up in the same area. They went to the same schools, but never really paid each other any attention, except when it came to Brad's height. Brad is six foot eight. Right. So... <laughs> Even in, you know, 6th, 7th, 8th grade, he was a giant, so you could not miss him. But their relationship changed when they got involved with the school's theater program. Brad and Summer even went to prom together and then went their separate ways until they reconnected in college. They rekindled their romance and years later were married living in San Diego, which is where Mama's Kitchen comes in. Summer, who has always had a passion for volunteering, was captivated with the organization's mission to provide free meals for those that are dealing with critical illnesses. Volunteers put together medically tailored meal kits, delivering them to their homes. Since Summer and Brad were inseparable, the couple used this volunteer opportunity to grow their love. You know, when you're in a relationship, you kind of come together around the things that are important to you. Um, <clears throat> and that was one of them that was obviously very important to her, and it's become very important to me. 20 years later, they're still volunteering, but now they have three children helping out, turning this into a true family affair. And Mama's Kitchen also brought Linda and John together. Both were volunteers, but never talked much. Until one day in the kitchen, John put on a little music while they were working. Both discovered they had a lot in common, and then Linda made her move and they've been together ever since. So then at one point, I, j I thought, well, he might be fun to have, you know, a coffee with or a glass of wine or something. So I gave him my business card and said, you know, if you want to have coffee sometime, give me a call. Two love stories that blossomed out of dedication and love to serve the community. And if you are interested in volunteering at Mama's Kitchen, we have posted that information on our website, 10news.com, under the Resource Center. Live from Webster, Marie Cornell, ABC 10 News. Both couples have great stories. Thank you, Marie.